Man, there's probably like... There's probably one of the stupid, like, dudes down here summoning them over and over. Hmm. I gotta say, this doesn't go- Oh, he buried me! No! Oh, this is potentially not good. I gotta say. Now I'm in a corner. Oh, this is very bad. Oh, this is extremely bad. Drink, damn it, drink. All right, we gotta go. We gotta, like, do something about this. And standing here isn't really doing something. Oh, God, there's a big one. This isn't good. Oh, man, we gotta go. How do I get out of here? I think there's a ladder. Oh, this is... I kind of want to, like, homeward bone out. Oh, no, this, the big dude is fucking pissed. Oh, this is... This is some Benny Hill shit right here. How do I get out of here? Oh, this? Nice. Well, unfortunately, they're just gonna keep spawning, and I don't know where the enemy is that makes them respawn. Uh, so we gotta go. <laughs> we gotta leave. Oh, is this him? Dude, you're an asshole. Get out of here. You're a total asshole just spawning these skeletons over and over. I'm very surprised that I didn't die, or that I haven't died yet, at least. Uh, the Skull Lantern's pretty good to get. It'll be a nice light source. Unfortunately, you have to put away your shield. Or your weapon. And uh, I figure the weapon's a little more important because I'd want to do damage, so. But you pull this out, and then you can hold it up like that, apparently. Apparently it's not L2. L2 just punches with it, but... You can hold this up, get a nice light source, and that'll be helpful for a little bit later on when we're roaming around in basically total darkness. Uh, I think it's pretty much like exactly like this, but even worse. So we'll have to deal with that when we get to it. Might as well come back here, make sure this is all cleared out. I'm pretty sure this ring might get you to to Gwendolyn. This might be the ring that I needed to fight Gwendolyn. So maybe I could go back there at some point. I think it was like the Dark Seance Ring. Oh, was it this one? Dark Moon Seance Ring? This ring is granted to adherents of Gwendolyn, Dark Moon Deity, and Lastborn of Gwyn, Lord of Sunlight, grants additional magic attunement slots. The Dark Sun Gwendolyn is the only remaining deity in Anrolando. His followers are few, but their tasks are of vital importance. So maybe if I wear that ring, I can get past whatever invisible wall is there. Otherwise, I would have to kill Guinevere? The, like, big, amazing chest, Phantom Guinevere, whatever it is, the illusion. Up. I guess I guess they felt like putting messages here for everybody. Ooh, miracle. Tranquil walk of peace. Won't be using that, but Oh my god. <laughs> That sucked. Not even sure exactly where I'm at. I think I'm like earlier on in the level. I think. Oh yeah, this is definitely earlier on in the level. So I'll homeward bone. This should bring me back to that one bonfire. We can try to move on and probably get to pinwheel now. There's probably not too much extra stuff that I want to do here, so... We can probably move towards pinwheel and... Hope for the best. Oh, come on.
Oh my god, the parry again. Dude, the skeletons, they're just too good at parrying. At least these fucking, like, floating faces showed up and helped out a little bit. Thankfully, their parry doesn't do a whole lot of damage to me. Though they are just gonna keep respawning, so that kind of sucks. Thankfully, their parry doesn't do a whole lot of damage to me, but it still sucks. I probably should have leveled up once I teleported back as well, but... Whatever, I guess. Need amazing item, Covenant ahead. Also, we have a Demon Titanite. I'm kind of worried that... Yeah, I'm kind of worried that these skeletons are just going to show up. I think they're... Are they walking backwards or towards me? I can't tell. I think, I think he's leaving. All right, good. Probably should have safety healed. This is a little arrogant. Oh, this is... Yep, this is a little bit arrogant, isn't it? Oh my god, that did so much damage. <laughs> Holy crap. Well, good thing I healed. It wasn't the safety heal, but it was a uh, good thing I fucking healed. Here comes another jump, I'm sure. Nope, not yet. It's coming soon, though. Coming soon to a theater near you. The repositioned jump from the Titanite Demon. Over and over again. We got the Eye of Death. I have no clue what that does. Probably something for, like, Nido's Covenant. It's probably, like, the Gravelord thing. Ooh, a Titanite catch pole. That's probably a rare drop. Well, I don't know exactly how this works. You might just have to, like, sit in this coffin for a while, and then it takes you to, like, Nido's boss arena, except you don't fight him. You can just join his covenant. I don't know if you need an item first to do this, or it'll just warp you there eventually. I know you have to sit here for a little bit, so... I guess I'll sit here for a little bit, you know, drink some water. We'll see if anything happens. You might need a specific item, though. Well, I guess not. got Tomb of the Giants. Yeah, this is like Nito's boss arena. I'm pretty sure. And if you come here and kill Nito, I don't think you can do this anymore. Or at the very least, I don't think you can join Nito's Covenant. Tears. So we got big old Nito in a coffin just chilling here. I guess I can try to enter the Covenant since I can just, like, warp now. I, I don't know if I have the trophy for this. Or not the trophy, the achievement. Oh, I don't even have to join it. I just have to try. Yeah, it gave me it gave me the achievement. But I don't really want to join it, so... I'm not really sure what's going on with his Covenant. I'm pretty sure that has something to do with, like... The disasters of the Gravelord message that pops up sometimes. I'm not really familiar with it. I couldn't tell you a whole lot about it. So we'll just get back in the coffin and get the heck out of here and keep working our way towards Pinwheel. At least I got the achievement. You couldn't see it pop up, but I saw it pop up. And that's what really matters. Can I skip this? There we go. Oh, there's an item over here. 
sneaky item. Except not really, because it's like right next to a ladder. Oh, the skeleton's coming up. There's probably a stupid enemy somewhere that keeps summoning them over and over again. It would be nice if I could find them. You know? It really would. That did a lot more damage than I thought it would do. Oh, here he is. Surrounded by two friends. Probably try to drop down up here. Uh, I think there's a black knight. So he'll he'll be fun to fight, I'm sure. I think there's another kind of like hidden thing you can drop down. Yeah, right here. Tough enemy ahead. Kinda wondering if I should safety heal. I guess there's two different places you can drop down. Oh god, the skeleton. Why? Give me giving me a heart attack. I'm trying to see if I can like break yeah, there we go. Can't really, can't really see anything, though. Oh, there he is. Oh, dang it. Oh, dude, he's got a huge axe. Holy shit. That axe is giant. Oh, my God. He's going to do so much damage if he hits me. Well, that wasn't a backstab. Kick your shield. Oh, God. Nice tracking. Oh, my God, he's just spinning around all over the place. There we go. Jeez. White Titanite Chunk? Oh, I didn't get his axe or anything. Kind of sucks. Uh, do both of these drop down to the same place? Yeah, I guess they do. And this place kind of sucks because of the stupid... The stupid rolling skeletons. This could be bad. <laughs> They're all here. Do I have any firebombs? I think a firebomb might do anything. So far, it doesn't look like I got firebombs. So this this could be a bit of a crappy thing here. Oh, I got a nice plunging attack, though. It killed, like, three of them. Oh, crap. Is this where the blacksmith was at? No. I don't really know how to get back to the blacksmith. One one flask probably really isn't going to do it for me. I think he might need to, like, be higher up or something. I don't remember where that blacksmith's at. Oh, God, there's a second one. Jesus. All right, I gotta, like, try to safety heal. I don't even think it was, like, a safety heal, really. Just, like, a regular heal. Yeah, I don't know where the blast... Maybe it was, like, a little bit further up, but I don't think I'm gonna be able to get up there. So I have zero flasks, and... Oh, was this it? Oh, I can just sit at this bonfire, I guess. Dude, that makes it, like, so much better. I don't think this bonfire was in the original. I think this is one of the only or one of the few bonfires that got added in. Man, these enemies aggro you from so far away. They they are good at aggroing you from pretty far away, I gotta say. That's already dead. I kind of want to deal with them. Dude, I actually need to level up. I actually do need to level up, or try to. Before I go fight Pinwheel and probably, probably die to him. I've been talking about how easy he is, but I'll probably die to him, so. 
Maybe a little more health, a little more tankiness might be good. I don't think I'll have enough souls to level up again, but maybe. I, I kind of doubt it. So I'll just hold on to that. Yeah, I could just, like, run past these guys. Oh, God. Can you guys leave me alone? Oh, we got a zigzag. I just want to fight Pinwheel. Oh, he tapped me a little bit. Oh, come on. Really? The body block? All right, we're good. Dead end. Oh, yeah, you can't. This is the end of the game. You just can't go any further. Weakness weapon. So we've got a rather large coffin, it looks like. And we got good old pinwheel. Generally one of the easiest bosses in the game, I would say. Probably by far the easiest boss in the game. Maybe outside of, like, the tutorial asylum demon or whatever. The asylum demon or the stray demon, whatever the one you fight in the very beginning. And maybe the Taurus demon. Like, those are relatively easy. But pinwheel is just, like... Pinwheel has no business being this easy when most people are going to kill him probably after, like, the middle of the game. But maybe it's also for people to, like, be able to kill him pretty quick and uh, be able to, like, kindle bonfires. But he just, like, he just takes massive damage. Boss? Yeah. Everyone's like, what is this? Look at this. That's Pinwheel. He's already dead. Poor Pinwheel. He's just such a pushover. We got the right of kindling. I got another achievement for that. We got some humanity, a homeward bone. We got Mask of the Mother, which I don't think that's what I was looking for. I think I would want Mask of the Father. I have no clue what Mask of the Mother does. Slightly raises HP. I wish I would have gotten Mask of the Father. I think, I think it has something to do with stamina. Boss. Skeleton. Yep, there's a skeleton here. There's, there's lots of skeletons here. But yeah, poor Pinwheel is... He's just not very... He's not very tough, you know? Shortcut ahead. I'm pretty sure this just, like, will lead you back. I guess if you want to go back for whatever reason. I can't see, though. I got just the thing for this, though. We got this bright-ass fucking light. Yeah, I'm pretty sure... Oh, there's actually something else over here. What is this? Soul of a Proud Knight? I feel like this is just the, the path to Pinwheel. Yeah, this is definitely the path to pinwheel. So we get like an extra item, and I guess that's about it. It doesn't even really give too many souls. What do you give me, like 15k for killing him? Does he even drop like a unique soul? Or no, he doesn't even have like a boss soul or anything. I don't think. But as you can see, it's a it's a little bit darker here than we've been dealing with. Uh, and it's really annoying if you don't have any sort of light source. There's a spell you can use, or there's this, like, headlight you can use. I don't, I don't know, like, exactly what to call it, but that's probably going to be it for this time. When we come back next time, we'll take on Tomb of the Giants, I think the area is called, and we'll keep making our way towards Nito, the first of the, like, major four bosses of the game before you're able to fight Gwyn, but that's going to be for next time. Hope you enjoy these videos. I'll see you guys then.